Hello, this is BBC News. I'm Ben Bulos with the latest headlines for viewers in the UK, on PBS in the US and around the world. Boris Johnson says 90% of people in intensive care with COVID have not had their booster jab as cases in the UK hit a pandemic high of just over 183,000. I think it is uh, worrying uh, seeing so many cases that we know, even though it's a small percentage of those people will become seriously ill, that will be a large number that's still um, going to be admitted to hospital over the coming week. As record infection rates are also reported across Europe and the US, the World Health Organization warns of a huge strain on global health services. I'm highly concerned that Omicron being more transmissible circulating at the same time as Delta is leading to a tsunami of cases. The European Court of Human Rights urges Russia to suspend the shutdown of the country's oldest human rights group. Prayers and thanksgiving as South Africa holds a week of special events celebrating the life of Archbishop Desmond Tutu. Hello, very good evening to viewers in the UK and indeed around the world. The UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson has urged everyone in the UK to get their booster jab. He says 90% of people currently in intensive care beds with COVID have not received their third vaccine. New figures show more than 10,000 people are in hospital in England with COVID. That's the highest number since March. Meanwhile, some UK doctors and pharmacists are warning they're running short of COVID tests because of high demand. Officials say more are on the way. Pressure is coming from a surge in cases. The latest data showing 183,000 people testing positive for COVID in the UK. That's a new daily record, but it's partly due to a delay in reporting results over Christmas. Our health correspondent, Catherine DeCosta, has more details.